Time Gate Channel. Atlantis deciphers the mystery of the Sahara Eye. In the book, Many Lives, Many Times, there is a detailed description of the land of Poseida, one of the three territories of the legendary Atlantis civilization. Poseida was located to the east of the Atlantic Ocean and was named after the sea god Poseidon. This place consisted of many small islands surrounding a large island with vast forests and myriad strange creatures. Today, scientists have discovered an extremely bizarre geological structure suspected to be the remnants of the ancient Poseida dynasty. It is the richest structure located in the west of the Sahara Desert. The traces found here astonishingly match the descriptions given by the philosopher Plato of an ancient city in Atlantis. It is of the med size with concentric circles. There are three water rings and two land rings. To the north, there are high mountain ranges, and to the south is a gateway to the sea. This place also holds vast amounts of gold, copper, iron, and various types of strangely colored stones. The most remarkable thing is that over 12,000 thousand years ago, the Sahara was a lush tropical rainforest. And indeed, 11,600 years ago, around the time Atlantis was completely destroyed by a great flood, the Sahara was also submerged underwater due to abrupt climate changes. Many years later, due to the vigorous activity of surrounding volcanoes, the Sahara was elevated once again, arid, sweltering, and with traces of ancient sea waves and salt. These remnants from the past still exist on the surface of the eye of the Sahara to this very day. The book tells the true story of a wealthy businessman's past lives. He once lived on the continent of Atlantis, was a pharaoh in ancient Egypt, and was enslaved during the time of Alexander the Great. In some lives he was female, in others male. The book also delves into his enduring relationships that spanned from one lifetime to the next.